Hi dear ones, I'm Salika. I'm happy that you are here and listen to the news and informations and impulses from the salt worlds. In this weekly um, message, today it's a special one. It is about um, your power and that you don't have to compare yourself or to judge others to find and realize and recognize your own power and your own being. If you are first time here, I want to explain a little bit about this um, um, video or podcast. It is from the salt worlds. The salt worlds are a level of consciousness and I read for you what the salts um, decide, uh, which is the topic of this time and now this one is a little bit special and it seems not to fit so much in this time uh, before Christmas but in fact it does so open your heart and much joy much fun um, by listening the topic of today is that you don't have to compare yourself with other beings to realize and to see your own power. And what does this mean? The salt worlds are very loving, but at the moment they push a little bit because they see that many of us lose their energy in playgrounds where they should not play anymore. Because it is more important that you have your focus on your own creation power and on your own being then um, taking a look what other spiritual beings are doing and for this listen carefully and let the soul healing energies and the clearing which flows through this voice and through this soul healing um, energies to you Many spiritual people are wonderful beings, of course, as we all are, but um, we are so conditioned to realize our own being, to recognize our own being by comparing ourselves with others. And this means, this starts as a child and it is uh, always in our life. Uh, for example, I am uh, better... In, at school than my friend or he is smaller than me um, he is a more loving person than me um, and so on I, I think you know what I mean and this is somehow how we are used to find our reality but now it is time that you find your own reality about your own being about your soul being by just taking a look at yourself and this means that you have to stop to watch um, other people friends spiritual beings i say spiritual beings because I, um, when I say this, I mean people who declare themselves as spiritual people or they have this as a business and so on. So that you don't feel less worthy than somebody else or you don't have to make yourself better uh, in your on your mind than other beings what does this mean this mean means that you of course uh, you can have somebody as an as an example or somehow a role model uh, for example somebody who has done spiritual work for 10 years and you you have the feeling that he is very um, developed in his spiritual skills and he knows who he is and uh, this person just shines his light and so on of course it is good to take a look and to say okay i i would like also to be as natural shining like this being 
okay, this I, uh, I does not mean at the moment, but if you raise people on a, somehow on a throne or on another level, um, it does not help neither these people than you. Okay, of course it is good to have respect and, and all this, uh, you, but you don't have also to somehow to, to pull them down on your level or to um, de de um, degrade them. No, this, everyone is at this point in life where he is. And it is okay. You don't have to judge anything. You don't have to compare anything. It is not your business. Your business is just to take a look at yourself, to take a look at yourself. And what this message from the salt worlds mean is that they want to somehow to make you sensible or sensitive for what's going on, how these plays are going, these games are going in, inside of yourself. Not Again, it is not of your, none of your business what other people do. It is about you. And you want to see yourself shining and you want to understand what is your power, what is your light, what are your qualities. And so take a look inside, take a look at yourself and let other people do what they want. And if, of course, you need support, you choose the um, healer or um, the, the spiritual teacher who is right for you. But don't degrade yourself as well. Everyone is at another point on his path and some of us went a longer path. They are somehow far away. It is okay. And you are at your point on your path where you are. And this is okay too. It does not help you if you want to be where the other person is. It splitters somehow your energy and you don't have the power to take a look where you are at the moment and to do the next step. So, The invitation from the salt world today is to really be honest with yourself, to empty your eyes again and again and again and just take a look at other people and see them with your soul. Don't judge, don't compare. It, is, it does not make any sense. And you don't have to raise up yourself to say, okay, I am... Uh, it is now... Um, Just an example. I am the, the best healer on earth. You don't have to do this because um, it is not the truth and you have your qualities and this is the best um, light you can shine out. But this will happen only if you take all your energies back to you. You stop from now on to judge, to compare to raise, to degrade yourself and others and just accept your own beauty. Because all these other games of comparing and judging are power games which does not fit us anymore. For this, the salt worlds bring this message today that it is better that we all focus on ourselves and so we can create something new together. This does not mean that you have to um, create together with uh, the others all consciously. No, everyone creates and together we will have a wonderful new creation by accepting ourselves with our wonderful unique power and the wonderful being you are and also accepting and appreciating the wonderful being of others. And this is the message for today. Please don't underestimate the power of this um, message, which means focus on yourself and accept your power, your beauty, your qualities. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good time. Be blessed. Om Namah Shivaya.